Jesus, he died on the third, came back So we can have the opportunity to repent God wanna give you peace, but you want that Prozac You take me at my word, that he can return that Back to the devil, cause he don't wanna hate you Either you wanna be free or you don't choose Jesus Christ can make you do like the whole you It's really simple, like one plus one is two so hello guys, welcome again. This is Blessed Major Brands, a home where you brand, we create, we design, and we do travels. So feel at home. I will say that I'll, I'll be answering questions that I find in my comment section. So I find another person asking, how do you brand a vehicle? How do you place or put vinyl in a vehicle? So I'm going to go through that. So it's, uh, it's not a complicated process. First thing you need to have a caterpillar machine. You'll need to have a vinyl. That is, you have a vinyl machine. You'll need to have a computer, and you'll need to have basic tools like you have the squeegee. You have to have this the paper cutter uh, or the paper uh, peeler. Uh, so, and you also have to have a vehicle. But it might it lazima kuya ko inyesa kuyam tu mingine. But all oh, those are the special, the unique things that you need in this. So, for starters, you need a machine that is called a cataplotter. A cataplotter is a machine that cuts the vinyl uh, to the design that you've set in the computer. So you have to set the design that you want. Like, let's say we are doing the word uh, faith. So faith, you can place it, uh, you can design it with any software. That is the Corel Draw, the Adobe Illustrator, the Adobe Photoshop but you have to convert your design to a printable or a cutout format that is you can convert it to an eps file or you can convert it to a bmp that is used to the art cut like there's a software called the art cut where you transfer it to a cutable format where it cuts it into the outline that you've designed it once you set this that is another tutorial once you set this once it's ready for cutting, all you have to do is you cut plot. You cut, you plot this design. Remember, they are always set. So it's only set in a way that for t-shirts, you put the F inverted. For a vehicle, you leave it the way it is. So what you do is that you print and you place the F in the right format or upright. Then you press print or cut. Once you press start, it's going to cut the design that you've said. That is, in this case, we are cutting the word faith. You have to have taken the measurements. You know exactly where you want it to fit. So while you're placing the uh, the cut, the way you're placing the cut on the art cut machine, you have to take the dimensions, that is the width and the height that you require. Once you've set that, you press it, uh, you place the cutter plotter, it cuts the design easy and makes it good so once you have the design all you have to do is you cut the part of the design that is necessary after you do that you need something we call the masking tape so the masking tape is something that you require uh, so that you can it can help you peel off the design and mix the uh, it attaches the cut part of the design back to the uh, masking tape so that when you place it on the window or on the body of the vehicle it does not leave or it does not approve the words that you want them to remain on the vehicle right? so what you do you place the masking tape exactly where you want it after applying masking tape all over it you can place one masking tape at the center and you peel one side of the paper and make sure it holds and then you cut part the part of the back or on the back of the sticker then from then with a the squeegee, you take that side and press, slightly press it from the center to the back. Remember this in this method you have to avoid things you call air bubbles. That's why you do it from the center to the to the far right or the far left, so that it does not get the air bubbles. You have to be smooth as possible. That is when you touch, you make sure it, uh, it goes to the left. Same thing you do to the right, you remove the center piece, remove the back part of it and use, using the squeeze, you apply slow and easy. Once you do that, you have to uh, 
apply pressure using the squeegee to make sure that the words attach and the vinyl is attached well and firm. So the remaining part that is remaining is that you have to cut out and peel off the unnecessary part of the vinyl. You can use the paper cutter which you can use it to trace. You can always pull the excess part but make sure you you can visibly see the cut part of the design. That is you make sure you uh, you can see the part that you're cutting. So it's an easy and uh, process that requires patience. So you have to pull it slow while you're observing. Any part that sticks, you can always use the paper cutter to ease the work. So you peel it slow, you peel it slow uh, until it's done. And to make sure it's well attached, you have to also apply the squeegee again. You apply pressure on the remaining words and the word fail to make sure it sticks permanently and well. So that's all that is required when you're applying a vinyl to your vehicle. You can, but this design you can use it for big vinyl, you can use it for small vinyl. With this skill you can do any graphics on any vehicle and it is something that sticks and it is permanent. It's a good way to brand your vehicle so that's all you need and you're ready to go and do whatever it is. So hope this was helpful. This is Blessed Major Brands. Like, share, subscribe. See you next time. Jesus Christ can make you do like the whole you It's really simple like one plus one is